Oop. and then we can just zoom, zoom out, zoom out. Anyway, so here we, we just wanted to give everybody an update where we're at, um, family and friends. We are sitting right now at an Anchorage in, um, what's it called? We, we think it's called Macamo, and it's a, it's in the Tuamotu. So if you go to Google Maps and you look up the Tuamotus, it's a tiny little atoll in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Uh, we sailed here this morning, and um, we left... Um, we left uh, Rory, Raroa, Raroia, maybe? Yesterday. It was also another atoll. How was Raroia? It was good. It was good. It was a really nice sail. It was about, it's about 90 miles uh, north of us. And the wind was perfect and the ocean was as like calm and flat as we'd ever seen it. And it was a really pleasant sail. Probably the best sail that we've had in the last month. Um, so let's see what's happened to our last update video. We sailed across the Pacific, or at least the eastern side of the Pacific Ocean, 22 days to Nukahiva in the Marquesas. That was super challenging. What did you think of that? I thought it was great. It was great, but anyways, did you really think it was great? It was fine. It was better than I expected. Which makes it great. Um, for me, it was really challenging because about 10 days into sailing across the ocean, uh, like 1,500 miles in, you start to realize, like, you, you cannot go back. There's just no way to go back. And if something major goes wrong, you've got to go forward and you're still 10 or 12 days away from uh, from land. There's land over there. It's the last we'll see for a long time. How long, Mom? 21 days. And so you're to you have to be totally self-sufficient. You start thinking about like, what if the water maker breaks down, uh, which would be terrible. Uh, because then, you know, you just have a little bit of water to drink and you can take a bath or anything. We have about 200 gallons. But you start thinking about the autopilot, what if the autopilot fails? That's what that's what's going through my mind all the time is like, what happens if something breaks? Anyways, uh, what else has happened? Uh, we went to Nukuhiva. Uh, what, did you like Nukuhiva? Yeah. The kids did a mountain biking excursion, uh, the older kids. And then we took scooters up there, and it was really pretty. Yeah, it was really fun. And it's like a mountainous, volcanic uh, landscape that's just really stunning. Uh, Nukahiva is amazing. And they have a nice little town, and the people there are super friendly, and you get baguettes in the morning, and fresh baguettes are super cheap there, and everything else is super expensive. Food is super expensive. And I'll tell you, our family went through, we would pick up... Ten? Between eight and fifteen baguettes. Every day, <laughs> like every couple days. Every couple days, we go in, and there people would just be like, "What? Fifteen baguettes?" And we're like, "Yep, fifteen baguettes." Anyways, um, Nukahiva was pretty awesome. The, uh, at, on Nukahiva, we went to Daniel's Bay, and it's a beautiful little bay, sandy beach. We stayed there for two days. We hiked up to maybe the most amazing hike ever. It's like the Grand Canyon, but inside of the tropical forest. But there's archaeological remains of the Marquesian people everywhere, and that was pretty stunning. We ate with the Marquesian family, or we paid them to eat with them. That's that's their gig. You pay them. That's how they make their money, and they make you dinner. Pretty cool. And then we sailed three and a half days, three days, to the to the Tuamotus to Raroria, and that was a no big deal, right? Actually, actually, that's not true. Then we sailed to. Uapo. Uapo. It was, and that's only like four hours, but that was probably the worst sail that we've had on the whole yeah. trip. Four hours, the worst sail was really rough, right into the wind. 
And it's why we didn't go down to uh, Hiva Oa and the Southern Islands, which are supposed to be great. But we, because we had to check into Nuki Hiva, we could not go down to the Southern Islands, well, without just sailing right into the wind for 24 hours. And we just weren't up for it. That's kind of a miserable uh, thing to do. So Uapu was awesome. What did you like about it? Uh, we did that awesome waterfall hike. Yes, in Hakaheitau, there is a fantastic, they call the Cascade Waterfall. And it has a beautiful pool, and it, it streams down on you fresh water, cool fresh water. You can swim in the pool, which we did, and that was really awesome. The kids loved it. And it's a short hike, it's like a mile and a half. We also went to the Chocolate Man. Yeah, the, the chocolate. Did you like the Chocolate Man? The Truman kids did not like the chocolate. Yeah. Well, what was wrong with the chocolate? It was terrible. It wasn't sweet enough for him. No, it wasn't chocolate. It wasn't. It was different, but it was. It was. It was homemade chocolate in the Marquesas. And it was. I liked it. I thought it was delicious, and I hadn't had chocolate in probably 22 days. So uh, maybe the kids. I liked it. It was good. And that was that was a rough hike, wasn't it, Truman? The hike up there. I got hurt four times. Yeah, it was a tough hike, but because the chocolate man lived way up on a hill, um, and then we took a car over to the other uh, Haka Hakatau or Hakahe or something like that, the other city. That was cool. Probably could have skipped that. And then after that, we sailed down to the Tumotus to Rororia, which was awesome. We did spear fishing with the ki with the boys. We caught a bunch of grouper. We shot a bunch of grouper with our spears. We, we did. Swam what, with you, what do you think of the snorkeling, Truman? Great. Yeah. All right, come down here so they can see. Did you like snorkeling? What do you like yeah. about snorkeling? I get to see a lot of animals. And did you do you like the sharks? No. No. We swam with the sharks, and the boys like that. And then. Like I said, we sailed here, and that's the live update. Anything else we should add? No. All right, we're going to put some of this together and post it today, and you guys will have it today.